Hey guys, welcome to episode 6 of the podcast titled Victoria Park. Victoria Park is the name of a poem, one of my poems, that was published in 2016 and was published again last year in my debut small book of poetry. I'm going to read the poem and then maybe talk a little bit more about it afterwards, but here's the poem. Victoria Park by Aaron Lembo. We choose to lie idle under the cherry blossom where pink petals act as our canopy and shelter. We choose to be far from the other residents. The park fills quickly when the sun pleases, rains. Parents and children play cricket for hours. Fathers relive their lost youth, their wives natter. Disposable barbecues plume smoke, charcoal burns as pork and beef cooks. Baps are buttered in advance. A group of boys ping a leather ball at one another. Their bags and t-shirts become white wooden goalposts. A gang of girls bathe under the clear blue sky, bass blaring from their pricey plastic phones. Terriers and Alsatians pound the fertile field, each darting after the well-endowed wood pigeon. I sit up and watch a bee stumble through the air, inebriated on nectar. I empathise its plight. I notice your open mouth, a string of dribble, sparkles on your chin. I wonder what you dream. Outside the shade of the tree, I go to marvel, the idyll, a temporal state of emotion. Clouds meander above the summit of a huge hill. On the horizon, I fear a brutal flood is overdue. So that's the poem, Victoria Park. Um, I'm reading, I read it from my pamphlet. It's all gone down one. And I can see that I had it published on Snakeskin Poetry's online website in 2016. And like I say, in 2020, it was included in It's All Gone Don One. Victoria Park, well, there's many Victoria Parks up and down England. Um, I definitely know there's one in London, but the one that poem's about is in Bath, in the southwest near Bristol, somewhat near Wales. Um, beautiful park, I used to live near it, I used to spend a lot of time walking around it, there was a golf course beside it that you could walk around to, a really beautiful part of Bath which is a beautiful city, I would encourage anyone to go there, especially if you're in a relationship and you want a romantic getaway, that's why I'd suggest anyway, it really is a beautiful city, Roman architecture and sort of gold brick in the sun, it's is beautiful and when you're in the city centre if you look at the surroundings you can see fields and um, it's at the sort of bottom of a of a hill surrounded by nature so it's a really great place and like I say I used to live near it and that's that poem was inspired I suppose by my experiences there I don't think there's really too much more to say on the poem uh, or its history but if you liked the poem like the video share the video i think the next video i'm gonna do will try to be romeo and juliet but i have realized that every video i've said i'm gonna make i haven't made but there are so many books to talk about of course Anyway, I hope everyone is good that's listening. If you made it this far, thank you. Have a great weekend and all the best as always.